So what is this? Well, this is called Fractus, a program I created that simulates some fractals, including the Mandelbrot set, the Julius set, and the Burning Ship fractals. I may add more fractals, or more settings to change fractals in the future, you know. For now, though... If you know these fractals, skip to this timestamp. So, let's begin with the star of the show, the Mandelbrot set. I technically had this program for nearly two years, and for all this time, and the versions I made before fractals ever came to be, that was the only fractal. Next up, the Julius set. This one's pretty interesting, having this double spiral shape. And finally, the burning ship. The equation for this is just like the Mandelbrot's equation, except you take the absolute values for the real and imaginary values before the same, squaring the whole thing. Now, here's some extra controls. Pressing E shows up what to do. Cycling through color modes can be done by pressing the keys from F1 to F8. Switching fractals with either K, J, or L, and you can change the scale by pressing Y or U, and the picture quality by pressing I or O, with some more advanced stuff by pressing F10. To go back to the main interface, press Q, or to hide it, press R. Anyways, now it's time to go further. Finally, let's start zooming in these fractals. Since the two billion of them have yet to be revealed. I swear, I could get lost in these for hours on end looking through these branches. Fortunately, this program uses doubles or 64-bit floats to render this, so it starts to show its limits by only one quadrillion zoom in some instances. At least it's not 32-bit floats. Now, here's some clips of me zooming into these fractals, getting lost within the world of infinity.
So, this is the end of all this. Well, thank you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. You can find a Fractus download link in the description.